Hey everyone, and welcome back to episode 213 of Terraria 1.3. Last episode, we started sort of a little mini garden here. I might get rid of those uh, <laughs> those fences, but started a mini garden, killed Moon Lord a couple times, still did not get the terrain, did not get the last prism. I haven't gotten anything new from him in so freaking long. He will not drop what I need. Killed the mechanical worm, uh, well, the destroyer, uh, six times. <laughs> and my god, with <laughs> Luminite bullets, does he not stand a chance? Skeletron Prime, of course, downed him in a heartbeat. It was not difficult at all. And yeah, I think we need to go to a new world really fast. Like, let me just save and quit. So let's just go to, uh, it doesn't really matter, Dungeon Guardian Bliss. Let's just steal some sunflowers. Unless, of course, I've stolen them from this world, which I'd be confused if I did. I mean, I don't even see any on the, the ground there. <laughs> Seriously? Another world without sunflowers? Can Is this how this is going to work? I don't see any here. Well, let's save and quit. Let's let's uh, let's go to, like, tita titanium. What's the titanium? You remember the W titanium world? <laughs> there we go. Look at all those sunflowers. That's what we need. So, I want sunflowers for a little, little garden thing in our house. A couple of them, anyway. And there they are. Awesome. So they give me a movement speed, and of course, they uh, subtract from the amount of monster spawns. So just having them in your house, I mean, <laughs> you don't want them spawning up on your floating turd in the sky, so why not just put that on there? I've, I've noticed settling liquids takes forever recently, which is really weird because I have like a, a super fast, uh, it's, it's a, it's, I guess it's an SSD, it's a M.2 drive, but technically it's whatever. Not getting into that. The, I don't know if, like, we're breaking Terraria or we just have so many liquids moving all at once or what, but I noticed that started taking a while. And it was only, like, an episode or two back ago, too, that I, that I noticed it. But, any hoodles, let's put a sunflower, like, here and here, and I can still just throw daybloom seeds down here in the grass, can't I? That does work. Like, as long as I don't harvest them myself, they should, they should do what we want. So let's let those go. And, of course, staff of regrowth. And, I mean, I said it last time, and I've been saying it for a couple episodes, but, like, what I'll do is I'll, when I'm done here, we'll have a world download so other people who want to use my world, which people have asked me that before, they'll, they'll be able to use my world. And I've offered it on my old series, too, so I think it's only fair that this one gets the world download as well. So let me just place these day blooms down, because why not? I guess I should top off these chests for you guys, because eventually you'll have access to them. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness. So what I want to do, let's tidy up the base a little bit and see if I can also see if I can place a bunch of my statues for my bosses. I uh, just like throughout the house. I think we're, yeah, I think we're good now. But yeah, see what I can do with the statues from the bosses. No, Meow Mirror, I did not mean to do that. Mmm, Sunflower, um, I guess I'll put, can I, I know I put one over here. Can I put another one over here without, without it looking goofy? I think we can get away with two without looking stupid. So we do lose the sunflower buff like right here. And we don't get it until we're all on the other side of this house. Now I don't think, let me test this again. I, I thought this was the case. So a couple pieces of grass. Now I think it does specifically require grass, but I don't think I can put it here because there's no sun above it. Now I was mistaken, unless it was because, because I, I tested this a long time ago, and I think when 1.3 first came out with Drizzle, I had a piece of grass or two down here. It, it was it was dirt, and we turned into the grass, and we tried to put a sunflower on it, and it didn't work. I don't know if that's because we were in the underground, if it was because we were in the jungle, or what. But if I can put one of those right here, I almost want to, like, try to make some kind of planter, if that makes sense. How can I do that? A planter. Um, because it's going to need grass. Oh, fantastic, a blood moon. I mean, I could put one, like, right here, like, that, that's easy peasy. And this is the center, so we want, let me move the marble. Oh, crap, I have to resummon my Stardust Dragon. Damn it. Here, kill him for me. Do, do, do my do my bidding. Get wrecked. Uh, this is the center. Now, the sunflower takes up one block, right? No. Okay, that's what I thought. Okay, never mind. It takes up two blocks. So do I want to put two planters here? Hmm. Maybe I'll worry about that a little bit later, because we're getting attacked, and I kind of want to move some stuff around. All right, this chest, I don't know why we had it here. We don't need a Hellforge at this stage in the game. That is what our other thing is for. That can get moved. Uh, the target dummy is gone. God, that thing's been annoying. Get rid of that. feels good. <laughs> feels good to get rid of it. feels really good. What I was thinking of doing, though, is like, 
do, I mean, do I really just want, like, a mound of dirt in my house? And call it a planter? I mean, I don't have any room in here where the mannequins are. And I don't want to do this. Like, this is not something I want to do. Like, like this. Let me, let me just show you. Let me demonstrate what I don't want to do. Uh, can, I, can, I, can I place you? Thank you. I, I, don't, I don't think that would be cool. Even if I did something like this. Uh, the hammer... Okay, yeah, I don't, I don't think... Oh, we might be able to get away with placing this. Like, I don't think that... Can I, oh, wow, you can't even plant that there unless it's a full block. Yeah, I, I don't think that would be cool. Eh, there's, just, there's not enough room with the mannequins. Not where they're at. Okay. You guys need to get out of my house. This needs to stop. Oh, that's right. I've got the solution to this problem. We don't need to, don't need to deal with the blood moon. We can just end the blood moon. Okay. And let's also use that thing because it's pretty and I think it overrides the blood moon. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Um, this can get sold. Alright, well, let's let's do what I wanted to do. I wanted to mess around with the, the statues from the bosses to see where I can put them. The ones that I have. So, let's get rid of some of the shnit. Uh, the gold chest. I can quick stack half of this stuff. Yeah. Workbench, don't need. Oh, the lever. Let's put that away. Da, da, da. See, I don't know how I would put sunflowers in the house to make it look make it look like it belong there. I don't want it to be obtrusive and look stupid. Dante, you can have the target dummy, you can have that. Stupid target dummy, haven't needed that thing in, thing in so long. Alright, how many um, boss trophies do we have? I know we have quite a few. Electron Prime, Cthulhu, Morningwood, Morningwood, Martian Saucer, Sharky, it's not really a boss trophy, but I'll pull it out of the chest for the moment. Moon Lord, Everscream, there's the Pump King, uh, Sand Tank, <laughs> Body Fish, alright, Destroyer, Queen Bee, and there's Plantera. I, oh, oh, the Ancient Cult, this one, that's that's a new one too. We got so many of these things in my inventory, oh my goodness. No room for dirt, let's just get rid of it. Now, they are pretty big, aren't they? You know, like 3x3 three three or something? Do I want to hang them like... I could put... Oh, they're not perfectly centered, but I could space them out like this. That would look okay, I think. Hmm. This might be. This might take a little bit of testing. Which ones are the most? Um, I don't know. The higher level ones, I guess you would call it. So, Moon Lord, Martian Saucer, Montera's pretty up there. Sand Tank, now Ancient Cultist is again. He's up there. So those are like the higher level ones. These these four. I don't want to put them. Ooh, I can put them in here. Yeah, Moon Lord, up in my, Moon Lord, up in my bedroom. There you go. That's you, you were a trophy, sir. Sorry, you've been reduced to just a trophy. And that is the same level. Okay, it was little, I thought it might have conflicted with the torch. So there we go. There's some bragging rights. <laughs> Ancient cultist. I mean, like I could. could oh, that's actually kind of a cool idea. I could put like the cultist trophy there. And a plantera trophy here, like using the spiral staircase. Oh, I like that. That's pretty cool. Um, <laughs> bunny face trophy. Yes, mad bragging rights. Is that even the same size as the other ones? No, it's not. Does, does that mean the shark tooth one is the same size? And the shark, the shark one's bigger. The shark teeth one's bigger. The bunny fish. Okay, the bunny fish trophy is probably not going to get placed. All right then. So, I can center. I can set. Oh, okay. I guess I could do that. I can center it with the torch down below. Now, how how much how much can I how far can I space these to make it look okay? So where's the destroyer? I'll put the destroyer one like here. Is that how high we did it? Okay. So we had. I'm trying to trying to make sure these are even. So that one there, yep. And then Skeleton Prime, Queen B, Queen B can go here. Okay. Yeah, that should actually work. All right, so Everscream, who's next? I guess Skeleton Prime would come next. Help us Skeleton Prime there, Everscream here. Now, of course, if I wanted to go farm all those bosses and get every single trophy, I guess I could do it. But I don't. That was never one of my goals, and I don't think I'm really that interested in the, uh, those trophies that much. So, that, so we have a sand tank trophy to work with. Now, where can I place it that almost almost fits? That doesn't look too stupid. Because it's uneven. I'm not putting it on my I'm not putting it on my glass window. That would be dumb. We could hang it. 
hang it in your bathroom, and you're just sitting there in the tub, and you're seeing sand tank. No, that's just stupid. <laughs> no, thank you. Do I have another one at all? Let me just check really quick, because... Okay, I know we moved some things to the placeables, but I don't think it was those. Hmm... See, now these are duplicate skeleton prime, morning wood, da, 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 pumpkin. I did put the pumpkin down, yes. I did. Queen bee, destroyer. Oh, the ice cream one, I didn't even use you. Okay, now I feel silly. Alright then. I'm sure somebody caught that. So, I could. That's well, kind of okay. But I don't like it as much as I thought I would. I can't, I can't center it. Oh, actually, I can center it. We could, we could stagger it. So we could do something like this. I'm not against this at all. Oh, that went up one more. So what I can do is I can stagger the trophies. So you go here. And if I wanted to, I'm losing my voice. Let me uh, let me fix that really quick. Blame the person at work who got me sick. Anyway, I, do I want to move the shark tooth trophy down? Oh, no, I don't want to do that. The reason I don't want to do that is because there's no torch here. But there's a torch here. Ah, I kind of like that. Just having the bragging rights. Let me turn off the, the thing there. It's so warm and lively, like, with all the colors. All the contrast. I gotta say, I do like it. I do like it. It might seem a little random, but I do like it. Let me remove that stupid painting. There's no point in keeping that one. That was never really, never really fit in to begin with. So we'll get rid of that one. Oh my god, I have 27 pumpkin trophies. <laughs> what the fuck? That's that's so much money in just trophy. So in the center, do I want to put the furnace? No, it does get centered. But then I couldn't have the anvil unless I do this. I like having the anvil more easily accessed. Or, uh, the, 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 the furnace stuff. I like that. The ammo box doesn't really... Hmm. I'm trying to think where I want to put these things. Get rid of that torch. The torch has been here for far, far too long. Okay. You... Uh, I, I mainly want to bring the crafting things in the house. Because I don't want them to be outside. That's never their intention. Never what I intended. Um, Tinker's Workshop. Uh, let's put you here. I could use, again, the space up top to my advantage. No point in having an alchemy table over here. We have them here for a reason. They're here so we can use them as a crafting recipe or station. Now, the solidifier, you know, it kind of seems something, you know, like if you're making potions or something, look look at it. <laughs> it seems like one of those things that just makes sense. And not, not to mention that I have a bunch of gel on these chests in here, so I like that. I'm going to just quick stack. We'll put that alchemy uh, station away. Uh, you can have your chest spot back. There you go. And sky mill. Gimme, gimme. And the heavy workbench. Where am I putting you guys? Hmm. Let me space this thing out a little bit. Too close to the stairs. Cool beans. This thing. Let me move you over. Same thing with the sawmill. I know it's too close to the outside. Still a loom up top. Sky mill. Uh, let me move that. Enchanted sundial. So pretty. I kind of want to put this like in my bedroom or maybe even up here. It's more of a more of like a high level thing that I think deserves a, a better spot. You know? I mean, this is high level too, but it's next to all my crafting greens. So that just makes more sense to me. So I'll put that here. Now that, is that everything inside the house? Let me zoom into my map too. Remember my, my recording button. I said that before. is the minus key on the far right of my keyboard. And it zooms out on my mini map every time I do it. <laughs> a little bit weird. So there we go. That's all the crafting stations out of the house. Get wrecked, butterfly. Out of, or in the house, out of the outside. Except for these two. Hmm. I don't really have much space. Again, I can put them up here. But the sharpening station is pretty fitting up there, just considering the fact that we're in a, uh, like an armory, basically. All right, and... Oh, God, that's so pretty. I do want to turn it off, though, because I like seeing the colors of the armor. Very nice. Give me this money. I don't even know what dropped it. Probably something from the Blood Moon. Something died. Don't know what it was, but something died. Now, the, the, little, the little wall pieces. I guess I do have to use a hammer for this, because they are walls. I always forget that. They're actually walls. So let's get rid of those fences. Bye-bye. They've been here for a very long time. <laughs> Very long time. Now, that torch can go bye-bye too. I don't want any of the normal torches. None of that boring, stale lighting. That's never been my intention. Let me move the sink over one too. Up, oh, the dog was in the way. I couldn't even see. Alright, stupid dog, get out of the way. Can't see. 
Now this doesn't even need to be here. We just kind of put that in there for S's and G's. So let me space things out a little bit more. And actually, let me bring you over a little more. Put you kind of back to where you were, I guess. Yeah, that's good. Okay, I like it. Ancient manipulator, it doesn't sell for anything. We have one in the house. We have one in the cyborg's room. <laughs> we don't need it, so let's just get rid of it. Now, I've got my little mini garden there. I could put a pond in it, but then I'd keep hitting it all the time. I, I'd, I'd, I'd fall into it, and I, I think that would get annoying more than anything. I could do this. It's, it's awfully close to street light, but I kind of like it so far. Because it, it, it smooths it out. Now, let's pull out the staff of regrowth. Obviously, it'll spread over time. It already did over there, but I just want to speed it up. Because I want to visualize it. So now I, I like that. We've got this thing here. Okay. This arena thing I'm not really worried about. <laughs> Don't even use it because we've cha since changed it. All the crafting stations are indeed in the house. And let me flip all my levers to the same direction. These ones should be facing outward, right? Yes, they are. All right, I'm being anal here. I'm being very picky. I'm trying to make the house look pretty for you when I do the upload. Hey. <laughs> sorry, squirrel. I'm sorry, squirrel. All right, everybody's house is in order. We've got a chimney on our roof. We've got a uh, fancy bedroom. Everything looks hunky freaking dory. I've got the trophies placed out. Now, again, there's more boss trophies, but like I said, it's never been my goal to have all the boss trophies, so I'm not really worried about it. I am kind of tempted to lower them one block. So that way they're not touching the base, basically, of these things. Yes, that looks a little bit better, in my opinion. Now, this thing, I mean, I may actually put it right here. Yeah, to take it off of that layer. And then put the enchanted sundial maybe like either in my bedroom or in fact like right here okay there we are there we are i like it so why don't we do why don't we do something funny really quick why don't we just take some lead bars out of the chest i uh, pull some oop, i did not mean to break that but it's never been filled anyway so it doesn't even matter souls of night souls of light um <laughs> Any of the other ones, not for what I was thinking about doing. Now we need lenses, we need... I think I'm just going to summon a couple of mechanical bosses and shoot them down. Have, have some fun here really quick while we wrap things up, guys. Because that's basically all I needed to do or all I really set out to do when we accomplished it. I can't believe it kind of creeped up on me so quick. <laughs> the ending of the series, if you will. Oh, I need bones. Okay, we've got, we've got bones for Skeletron Prime. But, I mean... Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's all I can think of, man. It's all I can think of. Did not get the fucking Terrarian. Blame Moon Lord. I tried. Didn't get Last Prism again. I tried. Uh, where's my bones? Where's my bones at? Am I just overlooking them? Am I, uh, I am overlooking them blatantly. Okay. So, what am I missing to make things? Nothing. All right, well, we'll do... Let's just do two of each, because I think we might go through this very quickly. <laughs> There we go, let's prioritize crystal bullets again. Considering what's about to go down, it's just better to use those. Oh my god. Well, maybe <laughs> maybe we want to use Luminite first and then focus on the Destroyer, I guess. Okay, so let's favorite these. Quick stack of the stuff again. Okay, I don't need those lead fences. Don't need those lead fences. No, sir. Okay, so I think I'm just going to go ahead and down the mechanical bosses for S's and G's, but I mean, I think we're done. I mean, I, I really I really hate to say it. I've done all the things I wanted to do. I've set out. I've made the amazing house. You can't tell me this house is pretty cool. Made a pretty cool house. Uh, killed all the bosses. Did the armor mannequin thingy, and that was my big, 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 big goal. Holy cow. <laughs> it's, it's sad. All right, we've got an, an hour and a half in-game hours before... Uh, we can actually do deal with these dudes. Why don't we summon this thing? Get my junk payment unit out, and let's have a little bit of fun here. <laughs> Go down here. Stupid truffle worm. Never showing his face. Jerk. All right, junk payment unit. Let's have some fun before 7:30 rolls around. Let's make our own caves. <laughs> this thing is so cool. Oh, look at that. You look at all these stupid things we're finding that we could have had so early on. <sighs> the heart crystals are just. 
here the whole time. I love the drill containment unit, though. Does it have its own natural light? Like, I haven't noticed. Oh. Wait, yes, it does. Okay, it does. Wow. That's nuts. There's a trap there. Fantastic. Game is trying to kill me. Thankfully, we haven't had to deal with that. Let's pop a danger sense potion. No. Oh, that's right. You can't. I always forget. You can't be in the drill containment unit and use, like, half of the things you have available to you. It's kind of weird. It just doesn't let you click with stuff. You got a uh, thing up there, a chest. Like, all the stuff that we missed forever ago. All the stuff we've overlooked. It's just been available to me this whole time. Look at all these traps! What's with all the pressure plates? Dear God! If you ever wanted to, like, contaminate the world, you know, you've got you got the tool. You can go buy it. Your, the, the fuel for it. The ammo. The, the solution. But, not something I ever needed to do. I, I like having a little bit of corruption, a little bit of hollow in my world. It's fun to have access to those enemy types. Alright, it's 7.30 already, so let's get out of this thing. Let's take the drill containment unit off, because that'll end badly, knowing me. Oh, put that away. Uh, quick stack, basically, as much as I can. Recall potions. Poopy, poopy. Uh, I'll hang on to the blink roots. Alright, so, let's have some fun. S's and G's. Gets and jiggles. Gets and jiggles. So, you... Oh, that's not cool. Good thing it's only the twins and not like the destroyer and it's killing Walter. Let's press one so that thing's not selected. Uh, Skeleton Prime. Can't the worm. Alright. Well, I'll press B. Might as well buff up. Come on, the destroyer. Get down here. Get over here. Oh my god, I'm not even trying to kill the twins. And look at them. Like, I'm going after the destroyer here. I'm sorry. Oh, we need to, we need to summon him again. Oh, that's right, I got some of this thing, too. Let's just... Oh, look at this, look at this, look at this! And there goes the destroyer. So whenever he summons and he binds up like that. <laughs> Alright, it's crystal bullet time, because these are... These are the bosses that definitely are weak against this. Holy hell, look at their HP. Look at their... Look at the twins! What? They just melt! I feel so bad! Alright, I gotta kill Skeletron Primer, there's just not gonna be two of you guys on the screen at all times. Here you go. <laughs> uh, I realize they're only the mechanical bosses, but they're, they're, they're the ones that are super easy to summon and have fun with. I really just wanna assert my dominance using <laughs> the FDMG. It's such a fun weapon. Such a fun weapon. Bye bye spasmatism. And Retinalizer's dead. Yep, everybody's dead now. <laughs> Did I get two of every loot bag? Two, one, one. Is it in the ground here, or I think it's just, I think it's not in the ground here, but I'll check. Yeah, it's not in the ground there. Um, <laughs> where, where's my loot bag? There's one. Oh, there's there's one. Okay, so we're we're missing the. I think that's. I think that's the uh, the twins. Yes, yeah, twins bag. Where's the twins bag at? That, that sounds weird. Where's the twins baguette? It almost sounds like, where's the twins baguette? Like, what? Alright. There we are. There's our bag. Hey, we got a destroyer trophy again. Let's open these up. What do I get? Dev armor? Dev armor? No? Platinum, though. Lots and lots of platinum. That's always nice. Uh, uh, my inventory is so full. Destroyer mask. I have like 14 of those. Here, the dirt. Unfavorite you and mushrooms. Oh, dope. Uh, there we freaking go. I don't know what else much to say, guys. I mean, really? That's all I set out to do, and I accomplished it, and I want to just end it on a happy note. And apparently someone said that this looks like a freaking chicken. I know, I know what this... <laughs> you said it looks like a chocobo, and I said something else forever ago, but... <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't see it. I don't see it. But, guys, I am. I think I'm going to wrap it up here. Episode 213, Terraria 1.3. The update came out <laughs> a long time ago. And I remember how hyped we were for it. We're still hyped, but I remember when it came out. I'm wrapping it up here. I will offer a world download in the description. I'll upload that to probably the same website I uploaded the other one to. And uh, I, I guess I could do my character file too, so you could have my character. I mean, chances are you're going to want to play as your character anyway to have your own name. And I mean, if you really wanted to, you could rename it using inventory editors and such. But... I'll let, you, I'll let you guys do just that. But again, we're wrapping it up here. Episode 213. Thank you all for watching. Thank you for all the support over... Oh my god, it's almost been a freaking year. 
Well, the update came out in June. It's January. I think it was June. Late June? Okay, so <laughs> half a year. A little over half a year. That's, that's nuts. That's nuts. So hopefully I can do some more Terraria down the line. I don't think it's going to be instant, like right as the series ends. Uh, probably still be doing other things. If you want to watch that, feel free. If you don't, I understand that not everybody likes every series. But yeah, eventually, again, we'll do either like a like a melee playthrough or like one of those things where it's a specific playthrough or maybe I'll get around to finally doing some tutorials. I don't know. I still work full time, so I can only do so many series at once, peoples. But again, I seriously, I appreciate everybody watching for as long as you guys have. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. And again, I'm going to say it once more. <laughs> Let's wrap it up here. Episode 213. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you next time.